and you kind of brought up some of the younger like talent this team has. And one guy that I think uh, is really special, and I want to like love to hear your like take on is quarterback Zach Wilson. Um, and just from reading everything about his backstory, he's obviously super committed to his family. I love that it drives home for Sunday dinner every night. But on the field, he appears to have all the right moves. What is so special in your opinion about Zach Wilson? Well, Zach's just an ultimate competitor, and he's also a guy that is all in on football. Like you always hear growing up as a player, you mentioned in my introduction that I, I that I used to play, right? I played for BYU and played college football and all that. But all all growing up as a good athlete, you hear football's not going to last forever, so you need to make sure you get good grades and study hard and align yourself for a good job and and this and that and. Look, I'm sure Zach's doing that to a degree, but this dude is all in. He has burned his ships, and he wants to be he wants to be an incredibly successful college quarterback and then parlay that to opportunities in playing professional football. So to me, the fact that he's all in on football combined with the fact that he's just a, absolutely a fiery competitor. And and quite honestly, that, that competitiveness um, can work both ways a couple of times. You see sometimes he holds on to the ball too long or he's running around in the backfield and one of his linemen will get a holding penalty – to me, that's his competitiveness that he never will give up on a play He until the very last minute until he's either brought down to the ground or the whistle has blown on the play. He's trying to make that big play happen, and that, uh, that to me is what sets him ap- apart from your average college quarterback. In all the games he's quarterbacked at BYU, what do you think was his finest performance to date? Uh, I would probably say USC, just the fact that uh, they were coming in with a lot of uh, juice, that you knew it was going to be high scoring, and so... Uh, you need, can't, the defense kind of needed to limit USC, understanding that they were going to get theirs, but the you still needed the element that the offense needed to answer, right? And even though that game went into two overtimes and it's not like BYU dominated them, USC is a very talented football team, and at that time were playing extremely well. Uh, you know, they, they lost a couple of games that they shouldn't have lost, but the, that US, the USC team this year is still a quality football team. So for Zach Wilson to architect that, especially coming off the hills of um, a disappointing loss to Utah and really a game against Tennessee where he didn't play that great to come home, uh, to come back home in the third week of the season and beat a USC Trojan team, which is a program US, uh, that BYU has not perennially had success against, was probably been his most impressive feat for me.